Hey Nelly Addicts, welcome to my channel and welcome if you're new. I'm going to be unboxing and if you haven't already bought yours yet, I'm sorry but this is a spoiler alert. It is the Clear Jelly Stamper Autumn Mystery Box for 2024 and it is the Mega Size. Now this is my first time ever buying the Mega Size. I usually stay within the small to medium range and I haven't bought this box in a couple of years. So I'm really surprised to see what type of things they have in this box. Stay tuned towards the end so I can let y'all know what my thoughts and opinions are. And if the box was worth the price tag. Also, I want to see if I can get a whole manicure out of just the items I found in this box. So stay tuned and find out. You all are going to see uh, some pop-up that says maybe specialty item for the box. The reason why I put that is because when I went on Clear Jelly Stamper's website, I could not locate these items on their website. And even if they are no longer available, it'll usually say sold out. But these particular items that you're going to see coming up, I could not find them anywhere. The search engine says zero results. I looked on a Google search and I could not find them. I also looked on the uh, CJS app and I couldn't find it either. So they may just be items that they made for the mystery box. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that, but those are my thoughts.
All right, so what do y'all think? How did y'all like all the items that they gave in this autumn mystery box? Like I said, it is the mega size, and this is the first time that I ever bought a mega size. So, question, was it worth the price tag? In my opinion, yes. Just the plates alone, which was like 27 of them, was equal to the amount that the box was priced at total. So there was a lot of odds and ends in there also, like the keychain. And I had a few duplicate items, like two of the plates I already have. And I also have the uh, brush holder stand, that crown. I just bought that a couple of weeks ago because um, it was on clearance. So I'm not too worried about the three little duplicate items. You can never go wrong with multiple stands for your nail brushes. And the plates, as far as them being a duplicate, that's okay too. Maybe one day when I get enough subscribers, I'll be able to do a giveaway. Or if somebody I know who likes stamping, they may want it. It's all sorts of things that can that I can do with duplicates. So I'm not worried about that either. So uh, one thing about I want to know when I buy mystery boxes, am I going to be able to use these items? Are they just a bunch of random items that the company was trying to get rid of? Or is it going to be something useful and something that I can continue to use throughout my nail journey? For this box, absolutely. This manicure was done with pretty much all the items that came in the box. The only thing that did not come was the nail polishes that I showed at the beginning. And I was just using those just as a background for the nail art. But everything else was something that I used that came in this mystery box. So to me, that is definitely worth the money. I enjoyed all the items that I got in the box. And I'm very happy that I made the purchase. Let me know down in the comments what y'all think about this box. Was it worth the money? Would you have purchased this or not? Let me know down below. Thank y'all so much for watching till the end. I appreciate y'all and to all my new subscribers and old subscribers, I am very happy that y'all tune in and stay tuned in. Don't forget to check me out on my Etsy shop, OCD Beauty, and check me out on all the socials, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, it's OCD Beauty LLC. And I hope y'all have a great day. I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.